it is Friday. Sun is beaming. Just taking Hector for a little walk. Over the, there's a massive field just uh, next to the car park. So, I don't know, as a few of you said, um, it's not really fair in being in the van. I don't really like him being in the van, but at the minute, um, we usually have someone that will walk him for us a few times in the day, but they can't do it at the minute. So having to bring him to work with me and walk him a few times. I, I, I just take him for a walk at, in the morning at 10 o'clock, at one o'clock, and then when I get home. So he's still getting out plenty. I know, I know what you're saying about it, but you know, it's better than him being stuck in a flat all day. But yeah, anyway. A lovely day. Um forgot what I was gonna say, but I've got um just gotta finish off the soldiers on that plot. What we was that on yesterday and then we've just inherited one of the other gang's plots. Um, there wasn't enough work to keep them here. So I've ended up taking on their second lift. Uh, got new lads starting Monday. Um, I've also supposed to have another lad starting on the HOD. I've got, I had a lot of people get in contact with me about it, being on the HOD. Uh, but I've got someone coming in for a trial day on the Monday. See what he's like. I'm more concerned about people getting on with each other um, than anything. Because if you can't get on in a gang, then it this just doesn't create a very nice work, working atmosphere. So, um, yeah. See how we get on today. Come here, Harry, to show you what. So, we're up here, look. This is oh, where we are now, look. Yeah. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Yeah. yeah. We're jumping on this plot here. Seven. Plot seven. Yeah. So, we're doing the second lift. So, plot seven is plot five, plot seven. So, we've got to look four. Preformed arches, so we've got one there. Where? These are soldiers, so we build that. Yeah. So we've got one preformed arch to get. Two. Where? Where's the second? We're not building this. We're building up to here, look. Oh yeah. But there will be two, yeah. So it'll be, we'll get them over. So you're gonna have to find them this morning, because um, while I'm doing the uh, soldiers, yeah. Um, with Amy. Uh, you can go and start getting this uh, this lift built uh, set like loaded, yeah? yeah. But the first things you need to get are the lintels. So you need to get uh, a, shed a lintel schedule printed off from Doan. Well, yeah. And it, it'll. Um, do you remember how we done it last yeah, time? Yeah. Yeah. It's, yeah, there, yeah, it's yeah. all there. Look, the the product product yeah. description is what you want. Yeah. That's what you want, and they'll yeah. all be in there. And you want the ground floor. Don't don't worry about the first floor. Where? Yeah, floor, yeah. We'll just get the ground floor. So, if you go up to Doan this morning, um, I'll sort this tub of muck out. Where? Just go up there and ask him for a uh, lintel schedule. For seven. Yeah, so you need to get the lintels, and then you need to get one preformed arch, uh, and that's, and then you can start bumping out brickwork. Yeah. I'll come up and I'll tell you how many courses it is. Uh, hang on, I'll tell you exactly how many is up there now. Right, so the same same height as the other building, two four. Wow. So they done they've done all the block work bar a brick and a block, a brickette and a block block here. Yeah, but on what? Yeah, I did through the fronts and the backs, but I left the um, just the walls in the middle. I left them down, didn't I? Wow. That was two brickettes and yeah. one block. So it'll be it'll just be one brickette, one block everywhere, wow. and then you've got to count how many blocks that is and how many blocks is there and that will tell you how many bricks is in it. Yeah. Well, you're right. doing, first, you're doing the brickwork first, didn't you? Brickwork first, yeah. 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 Alright, mate. So I'm going to need this today. 
Uh, what else do I need? I'm gonna leave my laser level, I'll get that later. Do you need a white hat? A white hat? Uh, where is the other one? You took it back to the bag. Did I? Yeah. You videoing today? Yeah. You doing a little video? Yeah, sun's out, I'm happy. Sun's out, you're happy today? Yeah. <laughs> well, better make sure they go and check your channel out then. What, what are you gonna video doing today? How you progress with your bricklaying? Yeah. Oh, Amy, for fuck's <laughs> sake. <laughs> Who told you about farting on camera? <laughs> All right. So I had a little message from someone called Tom last night. He sent me a video, a couple of little short clips of him laying. I asked for a few tips. So I sent him a message back. But um, so I just want to give him a little tip, give you a little tip, Tom, about um, how to take them up from a board. Now, usually you can tell you spot an apprentice or an inexperienced bricklayer from a mile off just by how they uh, manipulate the board. And what I mean by that is like, um, they don't round their boards up. Uh, um, it's good practice to round your board up because at the end of the day, you don't want loads of muck around the edges all drying out in the summer. You, you can tell us uh, an inexperienced bricklayer or an apprentice just by, because they want to just dig the muck out of the middle. Um, now, it, don't get me wrong, I do do it myself. Uh, if I know the muck's right for doing it, but ideally what you want to be doing is cutting it into it cutting You all right, Harry? There's only one It needs to go up there though. Yeah, do you know where it is? Yeah, they're on top of the bricks in the brick in the brickyards. There's there's two there's two two lots in there one's for us and one's for Well, it says on them five six and seven or seven ours is seven so yeah you can tell um by the way they it, it, the thing is you don't want to be digging out all day every day especially if you've got a bigger trowel it's not so bad with this little little trip trowel you could dig out with this all day and you wouldn't feel it but with a bigger trowel if you're digging in and lifting you a lot of the time you're creating a slight suction which you don't realize and when you're lifting it you create that slight uh, suction is creating like um, a bit of strain on your wrist without you even realizing because it's so little you don't notice it so really what you need to be practicing is every now and then just round your board up yeah can't find any oh, I'll grab some at break so really what you want to be doing is every now and then just get your balls rounded up And the way to take the muck from a board with the least amount of effort is to cut in round the front and pick up. So you always want, I don't know, about 100 mil gap at the front of your board. Cut in, pick up. If the muck doesn't need turning. But yeah, there's a little tip for you, Tom. Sorry. Yeah. Are you sure it'll take pre full arches? Yeah. Because you've got two giant pre-formed arches in there, which is for these two plots. Yeah, they go in the next lift, up, up on top. But thanks for thinking about it. Um, right. Well, maybe. Can you do me a favour? Uh, yeah, just see like, he's picking at things like this, look. You see that little hole there, look? He's picking at things like that. I know, I know, you're telling me. Uh, I mean, yeah, I mean, to be honest, you ain't gonna get much better than what they already are, but just get get a uh, you know, like you did, just get a um, uh, what are they, uh, slip slip tie, yeah, the metal bit, and just give it a good scrape through, yeah, pull this up as tight as you can. Take your gloves off for a minute. It's nothing, it's nothing that's going to hurt your hands on this. Actually, no, you might catch your knuckles in there. You'll be all right. Go on. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, I think that... Stop it. Come on, then. Get, get off. Get off it. Get off. Get off. Go on. Off. Get off. Ah, you fuck. Get out of here. 
Get in there. Get in there. Let go. Let go, you fuck. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it. Good boy. Kill it. Kill it. You're going for a swim, boy. <laughs> Give it. Leave it. Come here. <laughs> Dog. Dragon. Ten meters over there. Let's send him for a quick swim. You want a quick swim, boy? You got a quick swim? Sun's out. Come here. Let it go. Get it, boy. Here you go. Get it, boy. <laughs> Where is it? Get it. Where is it? Come on, come on. Where is it, boy? There he is. You see it, didn't you? He can't fucking find it. Good boy. Good boy. Is that nice? Is that lovely? Yeah, he's got so he's staying somewhere. I didn't know, couldn't quite understand what he was saying though. He talks very quietly. Yeah, he does. Uh, oh. Who's hammering in the stuff? Hammering in what stuff? Uh, yeah, do you want to go around and do that and then cut back the uh, cut back the damp? Yeah. <laughs> you look confused. Do you know what I mean? As a what? Oh right. Oh, what you want to get? Do you want to get the tools and that sort? And I'll quickly do it. Yeah. yeah. All right. No problem. Just chuck us a bit of muck now. I've got to fill these tops in quick. In my pocket. Putting this weight on here. Oh. Stop it falling forward. Yeah, do you want to grab that and undo that profile for his own? Make sure you got hold of the pro, that's it. Got it? Uh, I haven't finished using it yet. Yeah. <laughs> right. uh, can I have a bit of muck, please? Do I take my water tank? Yeah. 
Huh? Well, is it, yeah, it needs to be close by. You only walk miles for everything. Oh. That looks very wet. You just knocked that out. Oh. How is so wet? It's soaked. Was there water in the top of it? It's all right. Yeah, it was water in the bottom, yeah. yeah. Oh, it's, it's oh, lines up. Yeah. Is it what? Yeah, we'll just get the most of it done and then get that, just ask, ask him to get it taken over. It's a better set of spear and Jackson lines, these ones. They're lovely to lay to, but the only trouble with them is they do fray a lot. What lines does everyone else use then? Because I've had someone message me about some sort of pulled act line or something like that. Keep meaning to order it, but never fucking remember. It's my top, where's me? dry stuff off the floor to join up with We're just going to join this up and then we're going to go over and start this other second lift. It's been told we're starting that Monday after we finish that lift, which we'll probably finish that lift Monday. There's really not a lot of work in that at all. This is a hop up, I swear. I have no idea how you close it. And Harry, every time he picks it up, he manages just to close it. How the fuck do you close it? Do you know how? Something to do with this thing here, I think. Ah, uh, uh. It's well confusing. Where is it? Up. Ah. And closes. Oh, thank you. Thanks. Thanks, boss man. Yeah, I know. Sorry, Abe. Is that safe? Yeah, there's nothing wrong with that. Yeah, so Do you want to clean these boards off and put them on? Well, I thought we could just throw them in there. Yeah, we'll do that. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. As well, if we put the, ba the bags in there and then put that bag inside there, so the bags are still protected. Yeah? 
confused there, did I? You did look confused there. Uh huh? Yeah. Wolf whistling. That'll get his attention. Wait for it to be fucking a bit warm. Mind you, I can't see us having to do this for much longer. This is ridiculous. Huh? Uh, I can do. Uh, I've got, I've got my disc cutter to take over. I've got a few bits to take over. Yeah. If you can get it on, if you can get it on there, get it on there. What are we putting the uh, spare materials on? Huh? Blocks, bricks, these all, everything that's ours. That's... What do you mean? Well, what are you putting in here? Ben. Did you not want to just put. Can do. You need the broom up here, didn't you? Shovel you don't need. Oh, I'm going to sort out the trays quickly. Oh, 
I did have a staple gun to do this, but it doesn't seem to be working. So I need to get a new one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everything, just everything we've got here needs to go over. these and we're done up here oh it's got a few blocks bit of... oh that needs nailing over there look oh you fuck fuck cunt 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 oh motherfucker Wow. Lovely job. Oh. Leave the place as you found it. This is uh, the other lads plots that we've took over. I've been around it and checked it. It's a very nice and neat bit of work. So anyway, um, I'm gonna get some profiles set up and literally, um, I'm gonna mark it up because So to bring that out of touch, all I use is my bag of tools up here. Lovely, cheers. So just to bring it out of touch, all we need is a little point and trowel. A little point and trowel's in here somewhere. Oh, there it is. No, that ain't a point and trowel, but that'll do. Tuck tighter. Put it this side so you don't catch yourself. And let's do that. Just push it in a bit further. Because it gets thicker, 
so that's now spot on there as well just remember when you're pulling off a profile you need to like off of a box section anyway you need to set it out a couple of mil past the actual brickwork to start with because where you where you lay back from the line a few mil you need it to be a few mil past so your line's obviously going to come through now 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 that that's just away from that brickwork i can lay just back from the line and i know that it ain't going to be it's going to cut right to the bottom then all right we're up plumb there plumb there now i know what heights are for this plot uh i haven't got my there's my pencil there so we're gonna go um <clears throat> we are gonna go level across because their block work is bang on to there and the block work is level so we're gonna go we want to be level with this block work for the lintel to sit on level so we're gonna mark across here onto the profile so we're here that's our first type we've got hit now me personally uh, I like to bump 10 mil over a lintel and you don't want to do it in your first go um, you just want to give it I don't know I'd say 80 80 and then go back to gauge um, and trust me if you don't do it and you're on site and you've got to get over these it's because the lintels have a concave they're concave so at the back you know um, as well when when you're doing your um, arches preformed arches when you want to go over a preformed arch they do not sit to gauge so let's have a look at this it probably is gauge but that's pretty much bang on to gauge Just, that is to gauge but then once you've um, once you've got your lintel on, your, uh, your little bit of a bed, you've got a bit of um, DPC under it, you've got the concave shape of the lintel, you, you're bumping up another 10 mil to gauge. So that's where you want to go o over this with a 10 mil bed. You want to bump up 10 mil um, from this height to the top of here, which. So we're gonna go, we're gonna go 10 mil to gate, higher to gauge, which is 310. All right, so this is my finished height here. So we go 75, 150. And then add five mil, so we go 230, and then 310. And that should be pretty much spot on. So we've got, Oh, all right, hang on, and as well. So this is marked to hit. So you don't want to gauge from here up, you want to gauge from here down. Now, depending on how good the brickwork is, we'll see where we're at. All right, we've got a bump, 12 mil, which is nothing. So we'll go to gauge, 150, 150, uh, 250, 225, 300. All right, now, what I'll do is I'll just go like 78 mil, 78 mil, 78 mil, 78 mil until I get to that. Uh, actually, I don't know if that would make it. Uh, three, six, nine, twelve. Yeah, it would. Yeah, it would. <clears throat> so 78. Yeah, that's three mil bump each time. Three mil, three mil, three mil, three mil. I should hit it by that one there, but then if not, I'll get it by that one. But I need to make sure that I hit this mark because you cannot be lower than that you cannot be lower than that you can be five mil higher you cannot be lower well i'm just going to set that one up over there uh, i'm not going to bother pulling the line out that way i've only got a gut, um to to hit i've got one two three four five six seven eight nine courses to hit nine courses i've only got to tail out uh five bricks so i'll just do that with a level that end pull through here pull out with a level do the end uh, i'll probably start on that corner over there and then pull a line off of the corner that i built to the profile do the back and do the side 
and we always leave the side that is closest to the um, loading bay. We try to use that, tend to do that as last and try to do the walls furthest away first. Lloyd up. Huh? Yeah. We're saying he's vid what? Yeah. I don't know, what is it gonna be? Oh what? Me teaching you how to pick and dip? You should know how to do it. <laughs> Are you trying to fucking nick subscribers of my channel again? Huh? Interest, what, me teaching you how to pick and dip? Yeah. Because you can't do it. Because
go with speed. You say that every time. I'm actually slowed down to make you look better. Sorry, I met you in the middle of every course. <laughs> All right then. I haven't sped up. Oh, uh, as long as they're fucking laid right. <laughs> Believe me, I'm not going fast. I will give you the hard bit, have I? <laughs> I've got to return mine round the side, look. <laughs> uh, while I was waiting for Mark, I ended up just setting the profiles up, gauging them up, ready, nice and easy for Amy, so she could, rather than me, go backwards and forwards levelling, she can just pull it through with a line. Yep. You might go. <laughs> I'm not. I need to be getting that coming further. <laughs> alright, I'll go a bit slow on the next one, alright? Oh, you go as fast all you want, but don't show me up to YouTube, alright? <laughs> alright, sorry. I'll do it again. Back to my normal speed after the video stops. You're learning for fuck's sake. You're laying, you're learning, who gives a fuck? Why? Why'd you give a fuck? You wanna what? Cause you wanna what? Yeah, so take your time, get them right. I oh, know, that's what you can do. I like these bricks. These are lovely bricks to lay. Fall into place. No effort whatsoever. <laughs> they will do one day. <laughs> I mean, apart from being a little bit holy. And that one's a little bit, that one, yeah, you spotted it. At least you spotted it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. What's happened there then? Uh, get a level, you're below this. I don't know yet. It is diving down a touch. What's that to there? Let's see, that is level to there. Let's have a look. What are your beds like? Alright. Oh yeah, 10 mil. I might not have put this on the right spot, maybe. Let's have a look. I do struggle with it. No, you are to the right bit. What it, what it could be is a slight sag in the line. I'm going to have to just bring this course off and just touch it up a little bit. But was they laid right? They were laid right to the line, but it, it was nothing that you would have known about. It's just, uh, you've just gone to the marks and...
Can't do it too much, but I should be able to get it a little bit of a bigger bed. Obviously, yeah, you've been doing so well. It's all right. I'll lay this course, don't worry. Careful, I don't have too much of a big bed. Be a, uh, nothing, I'm just talking to myself. Just about, they're only a couple of mil above the line, so as long as it don't look too sad, it's all right. That's what I'm here for. Sorry? Right, so now you just gauge mark, gauge mark, and you want to just rack it. You need enough for a lintel, which is about, um, you want to go two bricks back from here. Yeah, so you want to lay up to this one, reason being, because you need the lintel to go on, which will come to about there, but then you need the damp to be at least 150 mil of a turn up past. So one brick ain't gonna cut it. One brick would only be the lintel to there, and then your turn up would be here which isn't far enough past the lintel. So you need to go two bricks back. So then it's, the lintel will sit there and then you've got the damp going well past 150 mil and then turning up into this course, which will be there. Yeah, you're gonna lay this course now and you're gonna turn, there'll be a damp turned up in there. Sorry. Huh? <laughs> Just, yeah, lay your bricks up to this brick here. All right? And then, only, and then only, leave that off, all right? only one brick back. No, that's not. It's two. If you lay bricks up to there, you're one, two oh, bricks. Oh, up to here, not this one. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. All right, all right. All right, get your snots. We've got wall ties, this one. Uh, have we got wall ties? This one? Yeah, we'll have to be this one, won't it? Yeah, we've got wall ties, this one, Harry. Going up there, Nay. going to be a bit of a bigger bed as well on these t next two, alright? Just put them through for us Harry, they go in between the ones that were last put there, yeah? I mean obviously these ones go where them ones are, yeah? And there, and there, but then these ones will be, yeah? And then in between this one, we yeah. need to make sure. Is that going to be 750 though? Yeah. 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 It's a good channel today. You want music back on, dear? <laughs> Fuck YouTubers. They're going to start disliking you even more for not videoing the day. <laughs> <laughs> I'm only winding you up. Consider me 
Oh, it's a little... Oh, that's good. Take that off the top, look. That would sit there and go off over a break otherwise, and you come back and you... That's it. Lovely, jubbly. Always get your snots here as well, their class of snots. Okay. Snots. See it, you don't want to get to that, it'd be solid. I mean, say, say, uh, it takes like, what, a second to do it with your trowel, or some people, when they build it, if they come back the next day and leave it, they've got to start chipping it off with a fucking trowel, and it's just easier to just do it when it's green. Come on in, let's go. Wait. Yeah? No? I don't know where they are. <laughs> where are my car keys? Home? Yeah. Let's go. This break means we're nearly at time for Mackie D's. <laughs> It's ready, look. No, it's a car locker, isn't it? Tarmac's done, look. No, I'm pretty sure he's coming in from this way, though, surely. It's not really much, he ain't got much uh, room to move around. He ain't got no room to move around. So, yeah, we're finishing this plot Monday, uh, and then we're jumping straight on that, probably Monday. Do you reckon that'll take us a bit of Tuesday, too? No. Ah, we'll get. Nah, we'll fly around that Monday. Hello, 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 ready? Ready? Oh, it's a bit fucking dodgy jumping there. Yeah? 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 Uh, watch that, it's dripping on him. Watch out. Do I want, what? A cup of tea? Oh, I'd love one, I didn't get one last break. You did! Oh, I did? <laughs> Oh, and <laughs> just stick in the microwave, that'll do. Here, my boy, come on in. Come on, I ain't got your stick, mate. Come here. Ooh. Right. Let go. Oh. Hit fucking go. Oh, bollocks. <laughs> you getting in? Go on, get in. Go on. Come on. Shish. <laughs> he's a good boy. He's a good boy. Oh, he's a good boy. Come on. Come back here. Come here. He's like, no. <laughs> What's this? <laughs> I got your stick. I got it. Got it. Get it in. Let him in, let him in, let him in. I'm Otherwise, he'll, here, he'll just sit there. You know, he won't sit in the back, he hates it in the back. Oh my god, fucking stinks. <laughs> ah, he's a wet dog.
Hello, bricklaying with Amy. A bit better today, ain't you, with a bit of sunshine? Yeah. Uh, we come across a couple of little problems, but nothing I can't get over. Um, the line's been pulled out a bit, so I've had to ease it back in on some of the work, but, you know. <laughs> um, Harry's pretty much loaded out. He's not far off anyway. He's got to get a few briquettes out. We've just got this little bit of uh, work done here. Sorry. Same is... <laughs> this is Amy's little bit of brickwork here. Look. This is Amy's. <laughs> Here's Amy's little bit. Oh, it don't matter, does it? It's, it looks nice. That's all that matters, isn't it? Speed will come over time. I thought about here. Sometimes you did, yeah. But yeah, no, I think she's done a nice little neat job of that. What do you reckon? Yeah. What do you reckon, guys? Lovely. Lovely old job. Lovely old job. Who are you, Tricky Bricky? Do you want to keep the drawings out or do you want to do uh, Just tuck them away somewhere underneath. So, I'll tell you what we do need though, we need that arch there covered up with a bit of damp or something. We don't want it to get soaked over the weekend. Uh, we've got the preformed arch to go over this one. Uh, put a few conkers over this one. Yeah. Not a bad week. Got the full week in, just about. I'll be live tomorrow at 7 o'clock, tomorrow night. And again, Sunday, 7 o'clock. Fans coming on and having a chat, asking any questions. Uh, yeah, have a good weekend, everybody.